Ulster Bank League Division 1A Player of the Year is Danny Reardon, Old Belvedere. <laughs> We've been the official community partner with Irish Rugby Football Union since 2010 and it gives us fantastic opportunities to work with the clubs up and down the country. The Ulster Bank League Awards give us an opportunity to spotlight some of the top players. We've seen some of our winners come through and represent Connacht and uh, Leinster and so forth. It's important that we encourage those players in terms of bringing some of the maybe past players like our ambassadors, Brent Cunningham, uh, Alan Quinlan. I think it's a must have. I think it, uh, it recognises effort and it recognises performance and uh, you know, it, it's something I think that could grow. Danny Redden got uh, Club Player of the Year. I remember watching him um, a few years ago playing against uh, Simon Zebo, Peter O'Mahony in, uh, in, um, in a league final um, and, uh, and playing really, really well. But he played maybe, I don't know, half a dozen times for Leinster that year. So there are guys who are moving in and out of the the amateur and professional ranks and, and I think that helps add depth to, uh, to the professional game and it helps to lift the level of the, the amateur game. It's, it's lovely, uh, it's very nice to, be, to, to win it. Um, again, like I would say, again it's more of a reflection of the team this season, how, how, how uh, good we've been together. But uh, yeah, it's, it's lovely to get it. Obviously, you know, you try and do as much practice as you can and look, it's great to contribute to the team on the weekend if you, if you can kick a few points and look it's probably being top point scorer is probably just showing how the team played the season like we were always in the right positions and and that's probably more of a reflection of, of that like you know it's fantastic that Ulster Bank honor uh, reward the clubs volunteers and also the RFU the support that they give the the club game I think there's a clear statement there that the, the support is there for the club game there's many great young players coming through there's, all, there's a pathway certainly to, true to the professional game, but there's always also a place for guys who are passionate about their club. Um, they're club players who, you know, they don't see themselves going on to become professionals, but they go out week in, week out, put huge effort, time into representing their club, and I think that's fantastic as well. It was my goal coming into the season, so I'm pretty delighted that, that I got it again. Individually, you do your own gym sessions and whatnot, but... Um, we didn't really do individual skills, like a person go off and do his own. It was always that training with people under pressure. Um, back three would go off, we'd do our high balls with a chase, that kind of thing. So uh, it was always just developing our skills as a team more so than individually this year. We just had a good season all around. And I suppose it's just a reflection on, on the, the rest of the team, really, that uh, turn your forward would win. It. We went uh, unbeaten throughout the year, 18 fixtures from 18. Um, couple of tight ones before Christmas but uh, it just kind of it's just snowballed and just kind of just kind of kept going and it's a young young, young, young enough squad uh, I think definitely the majority of lads are going to stick stick together um, I think we're definitely ready to, for life in 1A um, it's kind of been coming a while now and we're just we're really looking forward to next year.